we are here with Dana Jimenez at RE Mexico, and we're going to introduce a, a couple new listings here at the Toscana Development in Tezal in Cabo San Lucas. And before we get started, Dana, how are you doing? Good, good. Thank you. So tell us a little bit about this project. It's Tezal. Tezal is a really nice area. You've got a lot of condos. These are houses. It almost kind of feels like a like another community, Ventanas. It's just like large houses. So can you tell us a little bit about Toscana? Yeah, well, I call Toscana the hidden gem of El Tezal. It's a low density development. And this development was built the first phase around 2014. That is one of the reasons, as you mentioned, the lots are a lot bigger, larger than we're seeing right now, and the houses are like very spacious and, and nice. Yeah, and this development, it seems like it's, it's gone in phases. So a lot of people, like there's a development down the way that sold out, by the way, so this area is just very popular. But they're buying dirt. Here you already have the pool, you have the gym, you've got already a couple phases complete. You already have people here that are paying HOA fees. So it's not the risk on of just buying ground up development. This this community is, what is this, the third phase that, that you're currently selling? Yeah, that's right. And there's another one that is in pre-construction. So that's a good thing that uh, the houses are turnkey. Nice. Okay. And you see what you're buying. It seems like are most of the houses, they have the bedrooms downstairs and the, the common areas upstairs and they all have a rooftop with basically an arch view. Yeah, and this is very common here in Cabo, but a lot of people that are just beginning to, to come here, they ask us like why? And one of the reasons is because you have the best view on the living area, that's where you spend most of your day, and also the rooms on, on the first floor, it keeps them cooler. Yeah, and I've just noticed, especially too with uh, older buyers, they like to have the, the bedrooms downstairs just in case family members don't want to be going upstairs and stuff. So for me, that's just an added benefit. Can we get into some of the amenities here? What do you have? Do you have a pool? Do you have gym? What, what does this area offer? Well, yes, a gym that, that's very convenient and it's only here for the homeowners. A uh, very nice uh, pool, uh, kitty area like for, for the children to a playground and the barbecue. Okay, and this area, where is it located in Cabo? Is this conveniently located? Is this far? How would you describe this location? Well, we are less than a kilometer from the from the road, from the Tras Peninsula. But all this area is, is, is very nice, it's very, I would say, quiet. And most of the developments here are houses, not as much condos, but houses. Oh, that's good. And I actually, I really like the fact that it's a kilometer away from the interstate because if you get too close to the interstate you can hear a lot of the noise and this does have this feeling of just it's tranquil it's quiet it's family oriented yes and another thing that is really good that you we have the rooftop terraces with the fire pit so and a very convenient and comfortable staircase that you can go up so it's also safe you know because sometimes they put the little staircases that is feel like not that safe. In this case, they, they have them. Okay, and if you were buying this, okay, it seems to me like there's two types of buyers here in Cabo right now that I'm thinking of. One would buy this for their family. Another person might buy this as an investment property. Would you be able to rent this property out to families or something like that? Absolutely, this could be like a great um, return on investment for rental properties and you can rent it for weekends or, or even long term too. Okay. And what are the starting prices for this phase of Toscana? We start at four hundred thousand dollars and then we go up all the way to five hundred and thirty thousand dollars. And how much square feet are we talking? It's a little bit like twenty two hundred something around there? Yeah, just about. Okay. Cool. And if anybody wants to get in touch with you for more information on Toscana, how would they do that? Uh, you can call, uh, email me at da Dana at CalvoRealEstate.com or my cell phone is 624-160-0885 or if you put hashtag AskDana, you will find me anywhere in the internet. 